Hello, boys and girls, my name is Hotsusti and welcome back to another day we out mining. We have another platform. I think this is 14 by 14. Uh, this will be the base for some of our future projects um, uh, where we will build some farms but not huge farms but uh, probably farms not larger than we have in the tower behind there and i think here uh, at the bottom i want to have a few storage chests that collect the goods from this farm so that uh, uh, these things do not need to go into the main storage that we will eventually build as well. So let's figure out uh, the storage first. And then we will see what the first farm will be. We have a sorting system with some modules here on this side and the same thing on this side. And we use water streams this time uh, item alignment with cake because why not and I think if we uh, figure out uh, we need more storage uh, we can easily extend a bit in this direction so uh, this works well if uh, for example we uh, uh, push in the items against the uh, middle here and then they will go around and around until they find a hopper um, that can collect the item uh, which is very nice so um, now I have to figure out how to place the first farm and we need quite a bit of uh, soul sand for this one because we want to make a nether ward farm um, just because so i think we will need a bit of space between this here and then the the farm itself because uh, I imagine that from all the farms we might get items through a water stream and uh, uh, we might have to uh, to get that in here somehow uh, without uh, disrupting everything. In this corner we will have the uh, collection systems from uh, all the different farms. So this means we can basically start uh, right about here with our actual farm. And for this one we have the collection system coming in here on this side. And the way this works, we can plant the uh, nether ward on here. And then we will flush everything uh, to the side. And uh, this bottom layer is just long enough that the water stops here. But as you can see on this side, we have a, a gap. Uh, from the layer above, uh, which means um, if we would have water there, water flows down and then over. So we can basically have multiple layers of this farm with uh, just uh, a few uh, water sources right at the top. And I think. Uh, Four or five layers should be enough. I mean, nether wart is growing slowly, and we need to uh, uh, we don't need to harvest uh, them manually because that's the waterfall, but we have to plant them manually. 
and not all the nether wood will get flushed because uh, towards uh, the the uh, thin end of the of the water blade there is not that much pressure so maybe um, a few of the nether wards uh, stick around but we have to go in and plant anyway so that's not a big issue so um, i will build up the uh, uh, other layers and then we can see about a mechanism uh, how to uh, uh, get the, the water dispensed here five layers completed five layers of nether wart grown so well uh, let's see how this uh, this goes um, we push the water out here and then we will have to press the button again to pull it back in and uh, down there we should see the, the items going in they should all end up in this first hopper So currently it's just too many items uh, uh, so that uh, it can be picked up but that's why they go round and round until there are no more and now comes the joyous task of replanting everything and uh, I think I do that uh, best by uh, um, going top to bottom because then I can uh, drop down in the gaps. But that's it for this episode. Hope you enjoyed this nether world form and uh, join me next time when uh, we will do something different. Until then, goodbye.